Hey there guys, what's up? This is Micromoblin, and I'm back with some Minish Cap here. So, if you guys haven't, uh, didn't know, uh, Minish Cap was the first thing that I ever uploaded on this channel. And... I never really visited back at it. I kind of started two new things, which were Fire Emblem and Pokemon. Uh, but, I kind of, I always wanted to go back to it. Especially since I love the Zelda series so much. Um, so yeah, if you guys want to watch the, um, first two, then I'll put a link to the, both those up above. So yeah, last time we were left off after meeting some of the Minish, and we were out here in the Minish woods. And let's begin. So in we go. The Deepwood Shrine, okay. So... The Deepwood Shrine would be considered the first dungeon, of course. Uh, Alright, let's go in here. Okay, this room, let's see. So basically, most of these dungeons are going to be quite simple. I highly doubt it's going to be any difficulty. I'm hoping to be able to finish each dungeon in one episode each. Or at least get through the dungeon and then beat the boss in the next one. But yeah. Alright, there we go. First small key. Okay, let's go. Hmm. There's a locked door here. Let's see if you can find a key to open it. Okay, I have a key, guys. Alright. Now, there should be two of them that pop up here. If you hit them when they're upside down, then... They're... It's a one-hit kill, but otherwise you gotta hit them twice. Ah, do you see that lever? I think you should, you should be able to pull it. Just stand in front of it, and press R to grab it, and then press the D-pad to pull. Okay, got it. Alright, now let's grab this one here. This I always found pretty cool. Just the whole- oh, wait, what up? I let go too fast, alright. It was a cool idea. I especially like how Link's, uh, head gets all red and when he's pulling too much. Get up. Alright. Keep going. So yeah, this dungeon isn't really that big. You want to avoid these guys here, because... Well, there seem like spore monsters, but we can't really do anything. Wow! Look at that size of that barrel. Hmm. Oh, right, right. How silly of me. It's not big. We're just small. So yeah, um, in case anyone didn't remember, uh, in the Minish Cap we basically have the ability where we can turn into a small little being that is small, I guess, yeah, that's about how I would explain it. Anyways, yeah, so we got Link here, um, so in the last two things we learned about, uh, I believe his name is Elzo, oh my god, I haven't played this for some time, but yeah, so... We learned about Elzo here. Um, he joined our party. Interestingly enough, he is the hat that we have here. Even though you don't see... Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Push this guy back a bit. Come on. Okay, let's get in here. So now that the thing is cut from both sides... Uh, well, that might explain. Whoa! Hey, be careful, my lad. The barrel just moved. Anyways, okay, he doesn't explain it. So basically, now that we freed it, we can basically do this. Where we can spin it to get to the different sides of the map like that. Alright, now... Okay, we can't go in there yet. Okay, I believe there is another path to the other one. To the other side. Give me a second. There we go. Okay, yeah. So, last time I keep getting sidetracked. Last time on the Minish Cap, which I played quite a long time ago, uh, we basically found Elzo, which is the cap that we have here. Um, along with that, we met some of the Minish, who are tiny little creature type things that are gonna help us. Well, they kind of, yeah, they kind of help us. I don't know too much about it since 
This is also my first time playing the game properly. I mainly played with the Zelda series. I've played all of the console versions for sure, but a lot of the top-down ones I have. I still, I never get around to it. So, yeah. So this is going to be a fun experience, hopefully. I mean, I'm pretty sure it is. I just love the series so much. But yeah. Anyways, uh, where was I? There we go. Go. So yeah, so we met all those uh, awesome characters and now we're here in the Minish Wood. Oh great, I did the same thing again. Second. Wait, isn't there something here? Wait up. Okay, we can't push it yet. Alright. Mm -hmm. Okay, now let's take it to the halfway point. I believe that's correct. Uh, okay, that just lets us get out. Okay, take him out. What we need is something to hold down the switch. Okay. I am pretty sure... Is it gonna be this? Yeah. So, okay, let's get, let's get rid of him. Awesome. And down we go. Okay. Over here should be pretty self-explanatory. Okay, okay. Uh, yeah, let's just push him in. And since there's gonna be something inside, that. go back to the dungeon. I mean, what am I saying? I meant the room with the key. Give me a second. So with the key, we can open this door here that we were blocked from before. And let's check it out. Alright, we've got some more of these. Um, I believe we can go up here. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, I don't want to go here yet. Let me just get down here. Let me do this room and then I'll go down. that on all the way back there we go just want to get a first back so I'm pretty sure like I want to try getting with the game I want to try being able to get all the heart pieces and everything but some of that stuff might come in afterwards where I come back I believe there's a heart piece in this dungeon. Uh, yeah. Okay, yeah. Well, I just wanted to say that. Hold on. Now... Let's get this over here. And we'll walk around and push that in. I have to admit, this is probably one of the best looking uh, Game Boy Advance games I have to say. Personally, I just love the really vibrant colors. All the enemy look, designs look really nice. And it's all quite detailed too, that's like... Yeah, it just looks so nice on here. Like, yeah, uh, that's what I gotta say. Alright. Now that we have the key, we can finally do what we need to do up here. Jump down here. Alright, we got a little bit more of the heart piece. Well, the heart. Uh, okay, a second. Take him out. And 
where does this take us? Ah, okay. We can't do this yet, I believe. Or can we? Okay, no we cannot. Okay, okay, there we go. Push that, push that. We got the compass, nice. Alright. Okay, now we go down here. And, okay, I wanna avoid these guys still. Go and face the first mini boss. This should be relatively easy. So the idea is that you go and hit the front and you can then hit the back. Now once he gets back to normal, you do it again. Now, oh, oh, that was close. And that's it! There we go. And you got the Gust Jar! Alright, uh, let me set it. Now, let's set this to A. Yeah. I believe there's a heart piece down here. Let me check. Alright, yeah, I'm right. Okay, we got a piece of heart. We need one more, alright. Okay, okay. Hopefully there's another one this time too. Yes, alright. Maybe there's another switch to get up there. Okay, let me just clear this up and I'll be back. So when you clear up this side, you can get these two switches, which open up that treasure box there. Uh, wait up. So we got ten mysterious shells, okay. Alright. And I got ten more mysterious shells. Great. Alright. Uh, let me just do the other side and I'm back. Hmm. Okay, so nothing on the other side. Give me a second. Okay. Maybe it's somewhere else. Let's see. Okay, we went through there. We went through there. So then... Oh, there we go. Drop right in there, nice. All right. Now, now what? Unless we find a way to travel by water, we won't be going much farther. Okay. Take this boat here. All right. Uh-oh. 
Okay, so over here you have a bunch of pots. And what you want to do is you leave this one here. Just so you can push it onto the thing. Like so. And we continue. Okay. Let's keep going here. And we're back in this room, nice. So now we can get the key or whatever is in that chest there. that we have a small key here. Okay, 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 come on, come on. Now we'll get out of here. And let's go down. Okay. I'll meet you guys back over the door. You wanna go up here and then to the left. For this one here, you take this. You do that, okay, okay. Same thing here. Once again. Level it up. Awesome. Get that boss key. Or the big key in this case. And let's keep going ahead. Oh man, there's a red one, okay. Let's get back here. I believe this one should take us to the heart piece. Awesome! Four heart! Here, and I believe we are near our destination. Where, up? where, uh, where am I? Okay. Oh, the other side we go. Okay. That makes a lot more sense. Awesome, just made it. Okay, one last time and we're in front of the boss. Okay guys, so next time with the Minish Cap, I want to go on with the boss. And we'll see what happens from there. Anyways, see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.